Hello, procrastinators, and welcome to Nerd Cubes 101. Today, we will be looking at Luftrausers. Uh, this is a game you may recognize because I played a free version of this way back in Free Free Game Friday, I think 20, 21, something like that. Ooh, that was painful. Uh, it was essentially was this sort of thing. It looked a lot worse than this, and it didn't, you know, it wasn't as pretty. It didn't have as many people on the screen at once, but it was roughly the same sort of thing. You control a little plane in 2D. And you basically can flip and spin and throw yourself around uh, and you have to shoot whatever the hell is shooting at you. A uh, very, very simple little game, but dear god was it fun. Uh, and now this paid version has come out, which takes the same concept and just... It doesn't just expand on it, it improves everything. It just takes it apart and rebuilds it. So, the most important thing is the flying still feels amazing. Turning your engine off and just spinning because you fancy it. And then just pulling up at the last second, turn around and try and kill someone is just endlessly fun. Just the weight, the freedom you have, the weightiness to your plane, it just feels absolutely stunning. Nothing really feels like this. It is just glorious. Uh, ooh, careful there. The thing the last one didn't have, hang on. The music's doing the bit which is the you're about to die music. Same as the other one. It has a bit where it's like, right, if you're at this point now, you're doing well, but you are going to die and it's going to be soon. And I'm afraid that may be true. Right, it's going to take on this giant battleship that's down here somewhere. Where is it? There it is. I did not do well. Uh, yes. This game has a lot more stuff. The first thing this has is the hangar where you can customise your plane. So instead of just sticking with the plane you had in the first game, you customise what type of weapon you want, uh, what type of body you want, what type of engine you want. And there's loads of different types and they all control differently. I don't really want to spoil any of this stuff for you, so if you really want to see what this game is like, go and get it now and then you can come back and see the other stuff because I don't really want to spoil all that sort of thing for you. Uh, I'll go for the first ones for now, and then later on I might show you others. So we're going to start with the next weapon, which is the laser, uh, the next body, which is the armor, more health and slower movement, and the next uh, engine, which is the super boost, which goes very fast. You can see at the bottom when I change, the objectives change, because this game isn't just score-based, it has objectives as well. Uh, the objectives change. So the objectives are actually defined to each part, instead of like you have just your next three objectives to do. Each part has a set of objectives you have to go through, so you have to try and find the best combination of weapons, armor, and body that would work for that objective. Which is a really interesting way. It's a, it's a lovely little way of setting things up. Uh, I really quite like that. So yeah, if we launch with this little guy here, uh, what's this one called? They all have a different name. This one is called Turbo Rouser. So we have more armor. We are a lot slower at turning, as you can see there, unless I turn the engine off. And we have a laser beam as the weapon, which is quite slow to turn, so you can't ping yourself as much. But with the super boost, that does counter out a fair few of the slowdown problems. So this plane isn't sluggish, it just has a... When firing, it's a little oh, slow. Ooh, hitting two of those is a bad thing. Uh, you have infinite health, sort of. Well, you have regenerative health, sorry. Your health regenerates when you're not firing. So if you get hit and you keep firing, you're going to slowly run out of health. Let's plummet into the water to prove this point. You see there, there's sort of the sun in the background. That's your health limit. So if I stop firing, you'll see that starts filling up. So that means that the health is generating, and now I'm back in full health. Oh god, that's an ace. Those things that look a bit like Serenity, they're called aces. Oh dear, and they fire far too many shots. Oh, good thing I brought the full body armor. They fire far, far, far too many shots at you, and are ridiculously dangerous. Oh, thank god I took them out. Uh, as you can see, way more enemies on the screen than the free game. Seriously large amount of stuff. Uh, it, it gets really, really manic really, really fast. The other one was a lot slower than this. This is insane. I'm going to stop firing to get some of my health back and slightly run away a bit. Uh, ooh. Oh, come on. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. I played this for... Oh, the music's doing the cool bit. I played this for quite a while now. Come on. Because uh, I got an early copy of it. Uh, the video is coming out late, though, because of moving and stuff. But I seriously spent a lot of time... Oh, come on. Die, 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 die. Uh, trying to unlock everything. Ass trumpets. I died. But I think I got a thing. So I've completed the objective. So if I go to the next one, I'll have another objective to do. The top one says victory because I've done all of the objectives for that weapon. So I do like the original weapon and the beam. Um, so we can kill five different enemy types in one game. Should we give that a go? I think we should. Right. Double rouser, activate. Uh, right, let's kill that thing. One. That's one type of enemy. Let's kill a battleship. Oh, slightly more difficult with the battleship. Uh, everything takes melee damage. You could just collide with them. Especially with this guy. There's actually one of the body armors is you don't take melee damage. That's two different types of enemies I've killed. Uh, I'm waiting for a little jet to pop along. Uh, I've killed the battleships. Uh, where's the jet? Come on. Throw a jet at me. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There's no, that's in the background. God damn the background. Ooh. No, no one has ever said god damn to a background before. It's like, unless it fell on you and you're an actor or something. I don't know. I'm not an actor. I don't know what happens. Ooh, dodge. Don't fall in the water. There's Jet. 
Chase him down. We'll just fire the laser beam until he dies. Oh, straight through him. So that's three. What else should we go for? Uh, there's submarines. There's the battleships. There's the aces. There's the super secret giant airships. There's the evil, terrifying laser bastards. There's... I've not even killed the... I've, I've never seen the laser bastards or who fires the lasers. But I just... It's like, oh, there's a thing. And then you die. Uh, so this game has semi-random events that occur, which are quite interesting. Ah, an ace. I can take an ace out. Ooh, hang on. Oh, there's a battleship as well. That's not a winning combination for my health. Ooh, where is he? There he is. Ooh, they did, that does look a bit like Serenity's, sort of. Doesn't it? Is it just me? I don't know. Ooh, hang on. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Did I get him? No, he's there. Bastard. He, that guy could fight. He flies sort of the same way as you do and fires a metric shit ton of shots. So you want to be wary of him. Oh, no, 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 no. There's something weird. Going. There's the laser bastards. I see the laser bastards. Oh, God, run. I'm able to kill them. Oh, I've killed five enemy types. Maybe I could have laser... No. Those laser bastards. God damn them. Yeah, I don't... I'm not very good at killing the laser bastards. Uh, let's change the hang around a bit. Uh, so we've got kill 100 enemies in total. That's a pretty soon once we can keep that on. We can go back to the original weapon. Let's budge over to another weapon. Let's go to the spread shot. Uh, and let's go to the gungeon. Oh, this is stupid. This is a stupid thing. Your engine is now also a gun. This is called Greedhead. So my engine is now a gun, so I can fire behind me, sort of. Uh, and then I've got sort of a shotgun shot. But they sort of, these, because you've got a kickback from the shotgun, I'm almost cancelling out, so I'm incredibly slow. But you do have the aggression stuff. So you completely change your playstyle. Every time you change your weapons up and stuff, your playstyle changes just ridiculously. Uh, there's also a random option, which we may play with later, which I really love, because you actually, random has its own separate objectives. So it's not just the objectives of that whatever you get given. It is a separate, its own separate objectives. Which is quite nice. Oh, that's a lot of damage. He's fine. Let's go take on a battleship. Uh, I can barely get air at the angle. My god. Hang on. I've got to stop firing so I can actually take off. Because this thing has kickback. Oh, 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 ow. Oh, 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 a lot of shots. I like how they aim at you now. Dump, 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 dump. Yep. Yeah, piss off. I'm firing. All of these need to hit. Hang on. Get my health back. So this one, really good for keeping your, your body up, but not really fast. If there's anything you need to be fast for. And some things like the laser bastards will need you to be harsh. Oh, battleship down. Yeah, the laser guys will need you to be sort of fast. I don't know what they are. There's also the um, airships, which I don't think I've taken out once. Oh, ow, 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 ow. That's a submarine. Is that a submarine? I think that's a submarine. Or was that just the boat sinking? I think that's just the boat sinking. See? Almost full health, that guy got me. Oh, yeah. I leveled up. Boom. Uh, oh, I've got a new thing. Oh, no. That's a new color. Ah. New colours. In the option menu, when you get to level up and stuff, you either unlock your new um, uh, weapons and things. I don't know how the uh, weapon unlocks work. They seem to just be sort of random. But you also get different colours to colour the thing in. But I'm sticking with the default for now. You can find out what they are when you play. Uh, encounter a blimp, some stuff. Let's go to the hangar and let's change things around. Uh, let's have the original gun again. Let's change the body to the melee body. So this does huge amounts of damage. But is a lot weaker. So it, it, it does, it, I have no impact damage, so I can plow through people, but I can only take two bullets, which is quite dangerous. If we go with the super boost, that's a pretty uh, vicious combination. Uh, right, we're going to slightly change the game mode out. Uh, this has F SFMT S -F -M -T mode. Um, another game had that, what was the other game that had that? Was it Super Crate Box? Is this made, made by the same people? I have no idea, I have no idea what Super... Uh, SFMT means. In fact, there's actually a cheaper that popped up. As, what does SFMT stand for? That's really hard to say. Maybe that's what it's there for. But um, if you switch to that, the game is now really difficult. You can see that some of the things turned around. So I have to be on normal missions to get that bottom one and SFMT to get on that. So there are some missions set on the uh, harder mode. And it is harder. Oh, it's harder. Let's have a fly. What's this one called? Ramjet. So I'm really fast. I ram stuff and I got this. Okay. As you can see, you already get the power chips and they fire way more at you. The jets they fly past leave like a little string. This little string in their wake of bullets. Uh, everything is out to get you and I don't think I've killed anyone yet. Oh, that's death. So there's also giant missiles coming from somewhere to try and kill me. Ah, uh, sort of vicious. Sort of, I didn't even ram anything. Let's go and ram someone. Ooh, come on, go, 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 go. Firing, firing, firing. Nope, that, oh, that thing is filling up the radar. So that's the blimps. That's a blimp has appeared somewhere on this map. Uh, so I'm going to fly over here. Maybe I'll encounter it. Whoa, dodge, dodge, dodge. There's the blimp firing at me. There's a blimp. Oh, God. You have to take that down. Uh, they appear a lot in the uh, more difficult modes. Oh, my God. I've been murdered. This is a difficult mode. A very, very difficult mode. Uh, again, I'm going to show more of these things off. So I seriously recommend you go play it so you get some surprise and stuff. 
I, I can't recommend this enough. Ah, oh, let's do the nuke body. The nuke body's insane. Uh, with the super boost and the original. Yes! Fantastic. Right. Let's do some more SMFD mode. This is called the Kamikaze. Uh, basically, have I still got the melee? But no, I've got the nuke body. When I die, I explode into a nuke and kill everything on the screen and a bit more range beyond that screen. Hang on, man. There's a lot to kill! There. Yeah. yeah, I kill a lot of stuff. You don't get many points for it, but it's a nice, vicious way of doing stuff. Also, it seems you do more damage when you collide with things, which is nice. I killed someone there. I haven't fired a shot. Ran through that guy. See, I can now, with the, uh, I can just ram through boats, and it's not a, a huge issue for me. Oh, no, 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 no. Laser bastards. Where are they? Where are they? I want to kill a laser bastard. <laughs> yeah, I'll just dodge through a trillion bullets, shall I? <laughs> oh, this is such a difficult game. It's so difficult, but it's so much fun. Um, it is only this level. I mean, you can change the colors of it and stuff, but there's it's only ever like these two little things, these two modes. As far as I can see, I mean, I'm only level nine in this, so you might unlock things as you go along. Uh, uh dodge through that. No, oh, I clipped both. And I've exploded. Yeah, I love that, that weird skull effect. It's kind of creepy. And the skull in the background now. A lot of skulls. Uh, kill three blimps off the death. So if I can find a blimp and explode, then that would be a good thing. That thing is filling up the entire radar. I wonder if it's that blimp that I'm looking for. Right, let's just ram it. Screw it. They're sort of about this height. Fire, 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 fire. Be prepared to dodge. No, 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 no. Good dodge. Right, there it is, there it is, there it is. Get close enough, get close enough. Ramming speed! Did I get it? That was exploded after death. God damn it. Maybe I didn't kill it properly. Maybe it needs more damage. Let's go find another one. Woo! Oh, uh, yeah, now I have reflections and things. All your bullets have reflections, which look nice. Hey, you! Die in the face. And your friend. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. All right, steady on, steady on. I think we'll bring out the laser beam. Let's bring out the laser beam, even though I have victory in that. I've already done all the stuff. This one's called Batman, was that? Sweet, so a nuclear explosion with a laser beam and a super fast jet is Batman. Actually, that's fairly accurate. I like that they all have little names. That's quite fun. All right, ram him. Where is he, where is he, where is he, where is he? There he is, laser beam! Ram, 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 explode and die. Does that count? Hey, I did it. Three things after death. Lovely. Uh, now I've got victory on the uh, the nuke body. That's fun. Right, let's go to random. Let's have a random go. No idea what's going to come out of this. Confirm. So it could be whatever comes up now. Uh, so my current things, I've got to beat all the normal missions. So we'll, we'll drop back down to normal. I have to kill a submarine. I don't think I've ever killed a submarine. Kill 250 fighters in total and kill 50 enemies in one combo. Let's do this. What have I got? Luft Pirate. I have the... Is that the basic engine? I think that might be the basic engine. Oh, I have the lock-on missiles. They're very difficult to use. And I believe I didn't take damage when I ran that guy, so I've got the anti-melee thing. Uh, yes, I believe that's what I've got. Okay, so that's my combination of stuff. The lock-on missiles do lock on, but you can only fly four at a time, then you have to wait for them to die, so you have to be accurate. It's not. There is a very slow-moving sort of semi explosive nuke weapon that you got to be careful of, uh, which is even more difficult to find this. So the weapons get sort of more difficult to fire, but do more damage and stuff, which is... It's an interesting way of doing it. So there's always that, there's the trade-off of you've got to be better at the game to use the uh, the harder weapons. Oh, arse trumpets. Right, okay, launch again. Do I launch with the same thing? No, I don't. This is the Assault Bird. It's got the gun gin. It's got the same bloody gun. And it's also got, is that the underwater body? It is not. <laughs> nearly died. Is it the cloud? It might be the cloud body. There's a body that lets you survive in the clouds and there's one that lets you survive in the water. It's neither of them. I have no, it might just be the default one. Which has no real abilities whatsoever. Uh, but I always seem to last longer in... Oh, good grief. I'm barely surviving with this... This Is it the gun gym? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Doop, 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 doop. Right, let's go and try and blow some stuff up. They're really good for... um. Expl oh, no, I've seen what body it is. It's the bomb body. Sorry, I, I couldn't notice it because I was firing myself to so look rough and insane. But as you can see, it's dropping off a little bomb every now and then. There's a bomb that just flops out. So this body does just drop a bomb. It drops a little bomb every now and then. That's what I've got there. Right, oh, I switched to SMFT. Well, let's do that. Let's see what happens. The Vulture, which is the spread shot with the gun gin and the something body. I have no idea because I was killed instantly. I'm guessing it's the nuke body because I exploded. <laughs> oh, good grief. Right, let's try one more of these. The Sinker. That's the underwater one. Yeah, so we've got the underwater body. Well, we got the giant awful gun of death, which is vicious and what looks like the more basic engine. But it doesn't matter because I've been instantly killed. One more. Uh, humpback. Laser beam, massive armor, and sort of the default weapon. So there's even, there's engines and stuff we haven't seen yet in this. Uh, I think I've unlocked all of them. Oh no, I haven't unlocked all of them. There's three that are still locked off. Let's show, 
that there's three. If you go right to the end, see, there's on the right there, there's one that's locked off. I think I have to beat everything on that to try and get there, which is something that I want to unlock quite desperately. This was just called Fork. Explosive E. Oh, this is another engine. This is sort of the uh, hydrojet engine thing. It basically just hovers you. But it's Battlestar galactica -y. You basically just hover around until you move. It's, ha it's basically you fight in space, essentially. So you just keep moving in the same direction. It's slow, but it means you can keep moving in the same direction. It's very good for taking out boats and things, because you can just hover over the front of them uh, if you can line things up properly. Oh my god. I said the last game was bullet hell, and this must be fucking bullet everything. I have no idea. What's worse than hell? This is bullet canary wharf during rush hour, and <laughs> literally worse than hell. And that's everything. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I seriously recommend this. I love this game so very much. It's only a couple of quid, but you will go back to it. It's one of the best arcade games I've played for quite some time. Thank you very much for watching, and ta-ra. Enter the domain of the nerd cube. Videos dropping from above like bird poop. Enter the domain of the nerd cube. Videos dropping from above like